Hi, welcome to Small Fish Channel. I'm Coach Lei Hong. Today I'm going to share with you how are you going to get new customer. So when we talk about uh, marketing and we want to obtain new customer, this is a, a, a thing that every business wanted to do. Alright, so I'll give you a very simple formula. Customer is equal to your leads time conversion. Meaning what? Meaning this is your prospect. How many, pro how many prospect can you get? But, but getting a prospect doesn't mean that they immediately become your customer. You need a separate strategy to convert your prospect into a buying customer. So very simple example, let's say you want to have customer, you don't measure by customer. You start with how many leads or prospect you are getting. For example, let's say we are having 1,000 leads from your marketing campaign. You do flyers, you do Facebook marketing, you do all sorts of marketing and you get 1,000 leads, meaning that there is 1,000 people call you and get to know you. Out of these 1,000 people, you manage to convert, let's say, 30% of them. Right? So very simple mathematics, you will have 300 new customers. So you may have the next question is, how do I do this too? How do I get new leads? How do I convert? I'm going to show you some example. All right. So where do you find customer? Okay, let me show you this thing. You find customer here. All right. So when you market your product, number one thing you can consider is to tell a story. Do you have a good story to tell about your company, your brand? Okay, for example, we have here a handmade soap from Taiwan. Right? So if you look at their product and their website, you can find very interesting fact. They are not selling you the soap itself, but they have embedded and in, uh, integrated a story into the product. For example, they have named this particular product Qing Shuang. Qing Shuang, meaning that if they, they, they have written some interesting point over here that tell you that what is this product about. So they are not trying to sell you a soap, but the story behind. Alright, there's, there's another way to attract more, more leads into your business is to make your product really simple. Alright, for example, we have four different medicine name over here. But if you look at the medicine name, were you able to pronounce the name correctly or, or, or perfectly? Unless you are a pharmacy student or, or medical student. If not, many people will have difficulty pronouncing. I only know how to pronounce Panadol. Alright, so if you want to create a product which is easy for your customer to buy, why don't you do something like this? Right? For example, I have three examples over here. They have packaged the product in such a way. Help, I have a headache. Help, I have an aging body. Help, I have a blister. So when you have such symptom, all you need to do is just go to the pharmacy and pick the system, uh, the symptom product that you need. Next, McDonald's is brilliant in terms of creating easy to buy situation. For example, if you go to any McDonald, the menu is largely displayed on the board. So customer, even though in this case, even though you don't read Chinese, but you, it's, it's very easy for you to buy McDonald. All you need to do is just go to the counter, pick the number that you want and point to the cashier, even though you don't speak the language, and the, the, the waiter will be able to satisfy your needs. So simple, so straightforward. All right? Make it easy, easy to buy for your customer. And lastly, if you can do, do or work on your product packaging. Right here, we have some example that stand out from market competition. For example, here we have the spaghetti. If you go to a supermarket and you look at the spaghetti column, which one stand out from the competition? Very easy, this one. All right. So a good product packaging also help you to attract leads and convert them into customer. So there are a few ways we can do today. Number one, tell a good story. Number two, make your product really simple. Number three, create a cool product packaging to it. Right? I thank you and I see you on the next video. Thank you very much.